Hi. So today we're going to talk about prayer in lieu of the Beit HaMikdash. Did you know what the people did when they came to the Beit HaMikdash? They actually would bring an animal sacrifice. And did you know that that animal sacrifice would represent their animalistic based negative tendencies? So for instance, if someone had a goring personality, they would bring a goring ox. And if someone had a lustful personality, they would bring a sheep. And if someone had like a stubborn personality, they would bring a goat. So because today we don't have the Beit HaMikdash, we say Korbanos in the prayer service. So before you start, question to yourself, what type of animal would you have brought to the temple? And since you have prayer service instead, have in mind which animal you would have sacrificed. And do you know what happened? They would come to the Beit HaMikdash, they would build a bit of a fire, and a huge lion shape fire miraculously would descend from above to below and then it was consumed. So every day when we enter our Sidur and we begin this service of Karbanot, we can have in mind what animal we would have brought and then even visualize that holy, amazing fire in the shape of a lion consuming our animalistic tendencies. And then visualize yourself, what would life be like without that negative trait. And again, you'll practice in your mind the amazing behaviors that you would like to acquire and you will outwit your brain also. So rely on Hashem. Bring your heart's desires to Hashem and He will help you sacrifice whatever needs to be eliminated from your animalistic tendencies. Sound good? Why have to work so hard? Let God do the work. Bye-bye.